been a tale of two halves here on the floor of the London Metal Exchange for base metals prices this morning. Up to 1.30 we saw very little activity. Prices across the board were more or less in a state of paralysis ahead of this US jobs report for May. In the case of the copper market, trading in a very tight $60 range, floor is around about $73, $15 a tonne. Not much activity as we say. Data came out at 1.30. That showed the non-farm payrolls report, very keenly awaited piece of data out of the US. That showed that the US added 175,000 jobs last month, which was slightly more than expected. Nevertheless, it did prompt a knee-jerk reaction in the base metals. Prices initially pushed up a little bit higher. Then copper, for example, fell sharply like a stone. So from trading around about 73.20, 73.30 dollars a tonne, quick nip up, nip up to around about 73.40, then fell below 7300. Fund sales came into the market, they triggered some sales stops, right down to around about $72.20 dollars a tonne, before the market moved to roughly 73, 72.30, 72.40, still over $90 dollars down on the day. Other markets were not so volatile, but movements were seen as well as activity. Interest started to pick up ahead of the weekend. Traders behind me said that the extreme reaction seen in the copper market was not totally surprising. The dollar did firm up after the US jobs report. That seemed to indicate that there is a possibility that the US QE program, monetary stimulus bond buying, that may well be showing signs of tapering off. So that was enough to underpin the dollar, which moved off its floors and triggered the selling in the copper market. For the rest of the day, coming up to the end of the week, likely to be further activity, further volatility. Also a short week in China next week. Markets there are closed Monday through to Wednesday. So it's likely to be a double dose of volatility going into the close with more movement likely to be seen, possibly on the downside. This is Martin Hayes for Fast Markets on the floor of the elevator.